We all assume that we are feeling this today. So I'm just out here, I'm just trying to learn to fly this drone that I bought. Uh, it's a nice pink model as you can see. The reason I got the pink model was because at the time the pink model in this particular brand had a higher quality camera in than the black model. Uh, it's a true 720p HD camera instead of uh, whatever the 680p thing was in the black one. So I'm kind of getting the hang of this now. This is sort of my first time out in a field flying it properly uh, with no walls to crash into. So. So this was pretty much my last flight of the day and I just want to make a note that this was also the first time that I'd ever actually used the camera on this drone so I didn't really have any idea what sort of footage it was getting and because the drone itself is not really designed for um, going really high it's generally designed for sort of filming activities happening on the ground so you could uh, perhaps film your friends doing sporting activities or something like that it's not meant for super high aerial shots but as a result of that and me not having used the camera before you get these stunning images of a green field from uh, 10 to 15 feet in the air instead of um, eye level and as you can see uh, they're really spectacular to look at so I don't know if you caught any of that on this particular camera but I think the battery is starting to get low at this point because uh, it only has something like a about eight minute battery life but I'm definitely getting there on this one I might actually be able to move up to the more advanced one that I bought so while I've been out I've also been riding around on my longboard uh, this is the first time I've been out on it properly uh, just riding around my town getting to places and I've got to say it sure beats riding around on a regular popsicle deck uh, with the tiny wheels and stuff it's just so much easier on the feet less vibrations uh, and even you can hit fairly sizable rocks uh, with the wheels on this thing you can see them there and it won't actually kick you off it's really pretty good this is Gawler's old skate park well, pretty much what's left of it. All the ramps have been removed and this is just uh, the concrete pad. <coughs> this surface is actually excellent for skating on so if you ever want to just learn flat ground tricks this is the place to do it. <laughs> 